Okay. Good morning, Mr. Chairman, fellow uh, shareholders. Uh, I'm John Simpson. I am an Alphabet shareholder. I, I'm now, after a recent split, have four shares, uh, and I appreciate the growth in my investment. I'm also Consumer Watchdog's uh, Technology and Privacy Project Director, and my question is about Google's largest unit, uh, Alphabet's largest unit, Google, and the California Privacy uh, Act, uh, which is going to be on the ballot in November. Uh, they would establish the right to know what information is being gathered by, about you by various businesses, gives you the ability to tell companies to stop selling your personal information data, and empowers you to hold companies accountable for data breaches and breaking the law. Google was one of five companies to contribute $200,000 to oppose the measure even before the ballot initiative has formally qualified. Two companies, Facebook and Verizon, have dropped their opposition. Now, since Google says it does not even sell data about you, why is the company opposing this privacy protecting ballot initiative? And would you consider dropping your opposition? Kent, would you like to respond? Sure. Thank you, John. Good to see you again. Uh, see as, you. as you know, we have long been one of the leading companies when it comes to privacy and security of user data. We've just gone through a very extensive two-year-long effort with regard to compliance with the general data protection regulation in Europe, and we're bringing many of those protections to users worldwide. As you say, we don't sell user data, uh, and we are at great pains to make sure that people have great control and notice over their data. We're not opposed to regulation. We are in, in favor of smart regulation. Uh, we have noticed that a number of companies in California, not just in the internet sector, but across the board, have raised concerns that this particular ballot measure uh, may be unwieldy and uh, counterproductive in trying to protect the interests of consumers. So we have raised some concerns, uh, but we do continue to engage with regulators, legislators, in not just California, but across the country and around the world on these issues. I believe that this could perhaps be addressed legislatively before it goes on the initiative. Would you be willing to meet with the uh, sponsors of the initiative and perhaps come up with acceptable language? I don't, of course, don't want to go into private conversations, but we're always happy to, to talk to people, both on the legislative side and the regulatory side of, of all of these issues. Thank you very much. Thank you.